and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team Leader, guys. Today, I'm going to be going over my Thanksgiving Harvest promo player predictions. You guys were commenting down below that you wanted this yesterday, so I'll be doing my best. I promise you guys, the guys I name, most of them will be in this. Will be in this. I, I can assure you guys of that because they don't really get. They're, they're pretty repetitive when it comes to Thanksgiving. That's the one promo where you can account for certain cards. It's almost as guaranteed as seeing a Bo Jackson around Christmas. There's just some cards you can always account for. So now I know that not all of them might be in this promo, but a good amount of them will be if I go off last year's and the last few years trends. Now, guys, before we get into this video, you guys went crazy with the like button. You guys hit 600 likes yesterday. So we went 300, 200, 200 was the first goal, then 300, then 400, you guys went to 600. You guys just skipped it. So guys, I think it's time. I'm gonna set it to 800 today. 800 any video. If you guys can somehow, can someone get 800 likes on any video today? Can you guys even handle, I don't know guys. I've been telling you, if you all like it right now, you can do it. And you guys went wild this, that's 600. I know there's still like 10,000 of you guys forgetting to like it. So guys, this is it. If we can get to 800 any video today, I have to do a giveaway. Comment down below what giveaways you guys wanna see. Should I do Twitter giveaways, sub only giveaways, uh, like giveaways, coin giveaway, car giveaway. Comment down below what you guys wanna see as a giveaway. And all you guys gotta do is hit 800 likes on any video today. You guys, are, you guys are freaking wild. I have, and this was no incentive, that's the best part. I did not incentivize you so you guys to do this. You guys did it out of just support. So guys, you better you better have liked it already, because if you didn't like it already, we're not gonna hit it. Everyone watching this video, you guys smashed. I, I cannot believe you guys are 600. I don't know if you guys can now do 800. That's that's why I've never gotten 800 likes in the video. So that's up to you guys if you guys can handle that. Now also guys, make sure to subscribe to the channel, turn on that notification bell, come join the family, and don't forget to comment what kind of giveaway you guys want to see. Now into the video. So when Thanksgiving promo does kick off, now guys, you guys were asking what day will it be coming. So EA announced that they will be announcing it next week, which is weird. So they're not gonna give it to us this week. Which means they're giving it to us probably the week of the 20th, which kind of sucks because that means that we're going to have like a week to actually enjoy the promo because then the Blitz promo is going to start, which we're not used to see. I don't really like that format. I don't really like how they're doing that. They should have started it now so we can have two weeks of it to enjoy for the Blitz, but it kind of seems like EA is kind of like forcing out the content last minute. It's almost like they do the promos day by day. Like they don't plan this ahead. Like, yeah, let's put something together this today. Like, it's just kind of, it's kind of weird, right? Usually we see the promos middle of the month, especially the seasonal ones. And they can't say it's any different because Halloween we got around the 15th and we saw it, so, and Halloween's like the 31st. So Thanksgiving's actually earlier. So shouldn't we see it a little bit earlier than mid -month? You know, never mind. I'm not going to complain the whole video. Anyways, when the promo comes out, guys, we're going to see two sets. There's going to be two master sets. It's going to be a Thanksgiving offensive set master and a Thanksgiving defensive set master. Now, guys, I'm going to give you guys a list of players that I know will be, I know for a fact will be it. So there's the same guys every year. It's gonna either be Barry Sanders, Lawrence Taylor, Michael Irvin, Night Train Lane, and maybe like an Emmett Smith. But more than likely, it's gonna be one of those four. Barry, thanks, uh, Barry, Lawrence Taylor, Irvin, and uh, Night Train Lane. Now, guys, if you don't see a Night Train Lane in the Harvest promo, you will see him in the Blitz. Every year, they drop our first Night Train Lane either in the Thanksgiving promo or the Blitz. So expect one of those four to the master. I can assure you guys one of those four will be it. Now, as far as set pieces go, I still want to see a Mahomes, but I have this fear, right? EA has been up the ass of their limited time cards, up their own ass of limited time cards. Like everything like, oh, you guys want a new Tyreek Hill? LTD. Oh, Ezekiel? LTD. You guys want to see Deion's LTD. Everything that's good in this game, they, they put an LTD stamp on it. So I have this fear that Thanksgiving LTDs could be like, let's say, the cat, the let's say the masters aren't Barry Sanders or LT. It's Michael Irvin and Emmett Smith or Michael Irvin and uh, Night Train Lane. I have this fear that they will still give us Barry and LT, but it'll be as a LTD, which would really suck now, wouldn't it? I have that fear. I really think they might do something like that. Or Mahomes. I have this fear that they might give us a limited time Thanksgiving Mahomes. I I, I do, and I, I I can see it happen, guys. Now really suck because then we can't play with these cards till around Christmas, which really really sucks. And but but guys, who better than EA to do something like that? But Back to the point, as the set pieces, what do I anticipate? I could see guys like, I want to say Alvin Kamara, but he had an LTD. So I'm going to go with Joey Bosa. He hasn't gotten a card since his heavyweight card. Bosa seems like a good fit for a guy that could potentially fit the bill of a Harvest card. Now, he also had one last year. So again, I, tell, I was saying that Thanksgiving promo is typically repetitive. 
you see similar cards over and over again. So Joey Bosa only has his 90, his 87 heavyweight card, which he got like the first or second week of heavyweight, so he can easily get an upgrade. And he did get a Thanksgiving card last year, so it would make sense. Kenny Galladay would be a guy that I could potentially say get a one. And don't forget, there will be Turkey Trotters. So Turkey Trotters are cards that pretty much have to perform on Thanksgiving to get upgrades to their cards. So I'll go over those in a second. But like I said, as far as set pieces go, I want to say like Mahomes might get one, but if he does not, I think he'll get a limited time. Joey Bosa, I believe, is one that's like a guy that could potentially get a card and be in there. Now, Kenny Galladay is a guy that could be, he was a turkey charter last year, so I don't want to put him there. I want to say that he'd probably be one of the set pieces, although I would not be surprised if he was one of the turkey trotters again, but I don't think they'll do that. I don't know. It's weird. Now, turkey trotters, to go over them real quick, is pretty much they have objectives on them and they have to perform on Thanksgiving for them to actually get a card that's upgradable. So they start off at like 90s, and if they do their one objective, then 91s, they do the second objective, they're 92, and then they're sellable. Another guy that I could see that can get a card is Dak Prescott. Now guys, these set pieces, I'm gonna coincide with Turkey Trotters, because it's hard to predict which ones will be the Turkey Trotters and which ones will be the actual set pieces. Now it all depends who plays on Thanksgiving, obviously. So the Cowboys do play on Thanksgiving, and the Cowboys always get cards. And they, like a Thanksgiving promo is like the Cowboys, and Thanksgiving promo is the NFC East. I'm not even kidding. It's always like Eagles players, Giants players, Cowboys players, Redskins players. So I know we'll be getting a Dak Prescott. We have to be getting a Dak Prescott. He only has, I believe, he doesn't have that high of a card, I believe. We will be getting a Dak. Whether, whether it's a turkey trotter or a set piece, I think we'll be getting a Dak. So at minimum, we're getting a new Dak 90 overall. Yeah, he only has an 86. Dak's having a pretty great year. I know for a fact we're getting a new Dak on um, Thanksgiving promo. We already got a Zeke, so I don't anticipate a Zeke. We could get some low set pieces like Michael Gallup. We could get an Amari Cooper. An Amari Cooper is very possible. Uh, as far as the Redskins go, there's really not much. Maybe like an Adrian Peterson on the Redskins. A Geis, but Geis isn't even back yet. Maybe a Terry McLaurin. I can't see much. The, the Redskins just suck. There's not just not much to get from them. As far as the Eagles go, I'd want to say Carson Wentz. But we're getting a six series Wentz today, so Carson Wentz is out of the opinion, uh, out of the option on that. Now, the running backs. As far as low set pieces, we're, I'm telling you, we're going to see a lot of NFC East players. We could see maybe Miles Sanders, Jordan Howard. Those are like the lower set ones, like the 80 overall cards. The higher set ones are, like I said, it's going to all be, it's going to it's be a combination of Lawrence Taylor, Barry Sanders, Irvin, Emmitt Smith. Maybe another Troy Aikman, maybe Nitrin Lane, Mahomes, Joey Bosa, Kenny Galladay, Dak Prescott, Michael Gallup. Maybe Amari Cooper, maybe, maybe a Witten. Maybe a Jalen Smith. I'm telling you, there's gonna be it's gonna be a Cowboys. It's gonna be a Cowboys fest. I don't know. I don't, is that like just who they always pick every year for Thanksgiving, or is that just a theme they have? But they typically follow a similar format to that. Now, if I had to tell you guys who I'm excited for out of those predictions of who I think you're gonna you're gonna see, I know you guys. I, I could go all day on little set pieces, but I'm showing you guys the ones that I think are guaranteed. I'm not just gonna go give you guys like 80 overall and the 77 overall. So I'm giving you guys what I think will be happening. Now, the Turkey Trotters, like I said. It could be any players from any teams that play on Thanksgiving. So on Thanksgiving, the Bears play the Lions, the Bills play the Cowboys, and the Saints play the Falcons. So, Falcons and Saints, who are the Turkey Trotters from both teams? The Saints? That's a weird one. See, the Saints are weird, because I, I can't be Kamara. It can't be who they're watching, Michael Thomas, no, I doubt it. It's probably a defensive player, maybe like a Marshawn Lattimore, Turkey Trotter. Falcons, I want to say Austin Hooper, but he just got hurt, so I don't know if that'll be him. Maybe Calvin Ridley. I could see a Calvin Ridley turkey trotter. And then the Cowboys, like I said, Dak Prescott probably. The Bills, I mean, I don't think it'll be Josh Allen. It'll have to be one of the running backs. I'd say either Frank Gore or Devin Singletary, probably the turkey trotter for the Bills. And then for the Lions, like I said, maybe Kenny Galladay again, or even the running backs, but they have a best of running back corner. Right and then for the Bears... Mm, maybe Taylor Gabriel, maybe defensive player, but that pretty much wraps up that guys that wraps up the turkey trotter predictions because I could give you guys because it could be any player it could be any player in defense or offense It's very hard to give you guys those predictions I think I hit on a lot of them though You guys got a pretty good bulk of players and guys that is about it for the video If you guys are new to the channel make sure to subscribe turn that notification bell boys come join the family and Don't forget if you haven't already liked the video it might already be too late guys start running it up now If you haven't already come see if we can make history on this channel our first 800 like video and hopefully it's today you guys hit 600 likes yesterday i only asked for like three four hundred so you guys are going crazy i don't know if you know you guys crawled out of some 
I don't know, you guys you guys crawled out of like a trench or something. I don't know where all you guys came from. Because I was averaging like 100 likes. Now, guys, if you can go crazy today and hit 800 likes, I promise you, you guys can pick the giveaway down below. Whatever you guys like, whatever it seems like you guys like the most, that's the format I will be following. So, start running the like button up now, boys. You got until, the, you got until tomorrow. Same time, same place. Alright guys, I'm out. See you guys next video. Peace.